There is no end to the misery brought by the floods for millions in Pakistan. Large parts of the country remain inundated. The latest satellite images revealing the extent of the destruction caused, including a massive lake that has taken the place of a part of the Indus River. The UN chief has called it a monsoon on steroids, which has claimed over 1,100 lives. And in the latest, the World Health Organization has warned over, warned over the increased threat of further spread of malaria, dengue fever and other water and vector-borne diseases among thousands of flood victims. Officials in Pakistan have also raised similar concerns. Initially, some doctors said they were seeing patients mostly traumatized by the flooding, but they are now treating people suffering from diarrhea, skin infections and other waterborne ailments in the country's flood-hit parts. The development has forced the government to deploy additional medical teams, dispatch medicines and provide clean drinking water to the survivors. Pre-flood, if we were to see the night, we were to see the 50-60-40 patients in the night. The night duty is at 9 o'clock in the morning and at 9 o'clock. The historic deluge has impacted 33 million people. That accounts for 15% of the total population of 220 million people. Pakistan has received nearly 190% more rainfall than the 30-year average in the quarter through August this year. Monsoon rainfall submerged a third of Pakistan. The southern part of the country is bracing for more flooding as a surge of water flowed down the Indus River, displacing people and uh, the displaced are now seeking shelter under makeshift plastic tents. Further, Bahrain, a popular desti destination in uh, Khyber Pakhtunkhwa province, is now a town in now a town in ruins, destroyed by the incredible force of the flash floods. The residents are struggling with basic amenities after the floodwaters took away a lifeline bridge. पहले तो बहुत इजी थी कारोबार चल रहे थे सब क्यों रोजी इनको आसानी मिल सकती थी आप जो है ना अभी इसको 20 अगर 30 साल भी लगे तो उस टाइम वो उसी तरह नहीं हो सकता वो बहुत मुश्किल है और तो आगे अल्लाह मालिक का रिज़क देने वाला अल्लाह के साथ है लेकिन मामलात बहुत मुश्किल है Pakistan Prime Minister Shahbaz Sharif has called for need uh, to uh, multiply the foreign aid to deal with the crisis, calling the current floods the worst in history. The Premier emphasized on the food shortages threat in the country that is already marred with record high inflation. We are now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.